Hello, my loves. I was finishing a reading that I was doing on Instagram, and these three cards just fell out on the floor. So, literally, someone could be falling out. We have bad health, mature woman. So, I'm getting like an older woman could be in bad health because they were being deceptive. So, that is what I instantly see. Someone is going to have bad health or someone has bad health because they've been deceptive. Okay, spirit guides, ancestors, please give me clarity on this message, please. Yeah, a thief. Regardless of what it is that they were trying to steal from you, trying to steal your gift. Could be money. Getting income from a debt. Getting money for a debt here. Or just trying to steal your gift in which is great fortune. Okay, these, this card isn't even supposed to be in here. So, Twin Flame. So, did someone try to bring an ending to a Twin Flame connection? What is this Twin Flame that is a concern here, Spirit? Okay, sudden wealth. Twin flame concern. Your twin, I just heard your twin flame is concerned with money. Okay, someone's married. Okay, so what's going on with this marriage here? Depressed. So someone that's married, yeah, is depressed. Okay, a Gemini is longing for a contract. But they're needing to overcome their codependent issues here. Yeah, that was impatient and unwise. Someone's digestive system could be an issue. I'm seeing shoulder and arm. 
and knee. Okay. What is going on here, Spirit? What's the deception here? What's the deception? Someone being lonely and being deceptive. A woman of the family. Is deceptive because they're lonely. And now they're worried because they're fucking sick. What? They're hesitant about withdrawing from a friend that is jealous or a friend have withdrawn from them and now they're worried because they're lonely. Yeah, okay, so older woman. What's going on with this woman here? What's going on with this woman? Yeah, a tower moment. Someone's mother. Okay, so... Yeah, there's a tower moment for some Virgo and Pisces woman. Okay, for somebody's mother or, yeah, their mother. A Virgo and Pisces mother. Yeah, trouble for being envious. I'm not bullshitting, y'all. Okay, so... What's going on with this Virgo and Pisces mother? Virgo and Pisces? Okay, clarity on Virgo mother, please. Virgo, Cancer. Okay, so this Virgo could have Cancer or you're the Virgo and you have a Cancer mother. Okay, clarity for Pisces. Okay, so for the older woman, I'm getting Virgo, Cancer, and Pisces. Pisces, older woman. Pisces, older woman. So this woman of the family is a Gemini. It could be, what's this, Pisces? Yeah, devil with this envy and jealousy here. The devil is also Capricorn. So Pisces and Capricorn here.
de I'm definitely getting Gemini energy for sure. So these signs could be someone's mother or the friend. This could be your signs. And Aquarius memories. Justice for an Aquarius. Cancer, Virgo. Pisces. Okay, so Pisces. The cycle is going to be turning for joy. Your rebel. Okay, I'm getting Pisces rebelling against the devil, attracting happiness, the will turning. For happiness. And then I got spiritual growth down there. For Pisces here. Yeah. Patient and wise. So be patient for this karmic will to turn. You will be happy. For what you have attracted into your life. Okay, there's some foolish actions here with a Leo. Foolish actions with a Leo. That was risky. Health problems to an ambitious queen. So someone was trying to get someone sick. Someone was trying to give someone health problems. What's going on? Okay, a Sagittarius is going to have good news or good news about a Sagittarius. Falling in love, easy. So someone was happy about someone else dealing with a Sagittarius and ending things. With a Leo. Clarity on Leo here. Justice is going to be served. <laughs> yeah, look. Stable together. Cool, calm, and collective. The new boo has a hidden agenda. And that's envy. Collaborating. So somebody's new partner is collaborating with someone else and it's not going to go as expected. Okay, Taurus. Being stable together. So what about this Taurus, please? Yeah. 
Aries, a toxic motherfucker. So, Taurus, if you're dealing with an Aries that's a toxic motherfucker, think clearly about what it is that you're doing. Meditate. It's going to help you transfer your thoughts. Intimacy is unrequited love. You are sensitive. So if somebody's trying to have you as like a, a side piece, that shit toxic. Use meditation. So someone could use meditation in order to help them. Attract love. Okay, somebody could be getting money for a child, a, a boy. A Pisces is getting money for a boy. Or a boy Pisces. What is this? A Virgo is secrets about a boy getting money for a boy. Yes, yeah, the inevitable ending for that help. Fear of action, Aquarius. That could be what's going on with this Aquarius um, or like having memories about this. Yeah, it's a hard fight in their contract because of something that they went through as a child. Leaving love. So again, there has to be an inevitable ending here, but someone is fearful of that. Okay, Capricorn, so Capricorn, stop taking care of so many people or stop taking care of other people and take care of yourself. Capricorn, um, caring for others, anxiety, taking a big loss in your business or in your love life. So there could be someone that's wanting to leave a Capricorn, but they're scared that they're going to take a loss in their business. They could be dealing with a Sagittarius. Masculine. So I'm getting like teamwork to some bullshit. Whatever I said after your sign, then that's what it is that you need to know. But somebody definitely like there is a, clearly a inevitable ending for someone. And again, somebody doing some shit for money, they do anything for cap. They doing anything to tell. Bitch, watch your mouth. Okay, what's going on, Spirit? What's going on with this message here about someone being in bad health? What is this message pertaining to someone being in bad health? Look, a marriage ending, divorce process. So that's why someone is going through a divorce process because of some bullshit. That somebody was plotting. Okay, so what else, Spirit? What else? 
Victory and success is self-assured. Be determined. So someone was determined to have this divorce process here, and that's why the motherfuckers are sick? Yeah, they were dedicated to ending a marriage. Someone's psychic. So they knew that someone was cheating. They're uncovering crime about karmics and their lack of accountability. Someone could be going through a divorce process, being disciplined, working hard. Someone could be a psychic and they're uncovering crime here. Or they're moving on from someone who's a cheater, who has an absent mom, who doesn't communicate well, who's manipulative and overly critical. Okay, please give me more clarity on this, please. Impatient, disloyal, broken promises, obsessed with material things. So that is why this marriage is ending. Someone has a child with special needs, and that's the reason why they are, like, taking on this child or something like using a child for money. I'm getting that. Yeah, abusive to a child with special needs. Okay, so what's going on here? What's going on here, Seer? Please give me more clarity on what is going on here. I wanted attention, fertility issues, a lack of self-belief. So what's going on here, Spirit? Oh. Judgment is being called for those that are cheating and being obsessive, being abusive. Okay, I see someone being self-employed here, but they're happy is unfamily because they are delaying the inevitable ending here. Someone's deceitful. A young person is holding on to the past. Emotionally weak guy. Someone having an affair, a cheat, a con man, someone getting raped and that being exposed, conflicts, fighting, disagreement, chaos. <clears throat> yeah, where there's trust issues, someone's marriage is being canceled now. Again, the divorce process, legal matters. So someone's going through some legal issues right now. Yeah, suddenly leaving. Withdrawing from this. Someone having two different paths. Okay, so what's going on with this legal matter here? What's going on with this legal matter, please, Garrett? Revoked offer. Jumping to conclusions, one night stands, that's why they're in court. 
yeah bad news a breakup unrequited love so if you guys are in court you could be getting some bad news or that's what this unrequited love one night stand and or someone's jumping to conclusions about a one night stand and it's causing sadness yeah, with this gossip. Yeah, someone's letting go of their fear, letting go of regret with this divorce process. Okay, a mature male, loyal, tolerant, caring, friendly, and devoted. A renewal, adventurous, charming, sweeping you off of your feet. Yeah, recovering slowly from this chaos. So I feel like regardless of which way, if like you guys have already finished it, I feel like someone else could be coming in after you've let go of the stagnant shit or this is your partner yeah look letting go endings changes new beginnings divorce heartbroken resolving childhood issues Your guys are protecting you from whatever bullshit these people are doing. Yeah. Letting go of the liar and the cheater. And light at the end of the tunnel. As you slowly heal, you gain your freedom and your innocence back. Dreams do come true. You're going to be moving forward and reclaiming your power. You could have withdrawn because someone was dealing with a prostitute. And that is the truth. And karmic justice is going to be served because of that. That could have caused you to have low self-esteem and to go and reevaluate yourself for spiritual enlightenment. But I feel like once you get a grip on this, then everything is going to be okay here. Um, let's see. Yeah, you had an unconventional relationship and you had a lack of clarity of it, but now you're going to, to have a thirst for knowledge. There could be fertility being reborn for a single mom. There was a lack of progress because someone was abusing their power with the reckless bullshit causing imbalances here. Yeah, but look, we have a good mom, a healer, a witch, a grounded female, a homemaker. Not seeing the truth about a soulmate here. And the cycles of life. Okay, so you could be feeling trapped because of some delayed news, but just be patient. Your dreams are going to come true.
Yeah, the calm after the storm. Okay, so let's see. And then I'm going to end this video, baby. Okay, plug. Plug, love. I just heard plug, love. Okay, so someone could be the plug. And they got a life sentence. Damn. Shit. Someone is a great dad here. A biracial relationship. Don't forget, you're paying your tax money to pedophiles. Just a friendly reminder. I'm living in a timeline of peace, happiness, and stability, and in my divine life purpose. So mote it be for my viewers, whoever resonates with this message here. My bills will be paid on time, no worries. Yeah, somebody's partner is on drugs here. Reading is fundamental, so make sure that you are reading your contracts. You're reading over paperwork that you're doing. Okay, great car. Someone here has a great car. Read over your contracts if someone's getting a great car. Watch for strangers near you to soon become a friend. So someone with a great car could become your friend very soon. You will make a name for yourself in the field of entertainment. Let's get maybe two more. My girlfriend rocks. So yeah, somebody is in a, this could be this biracial couple. Okay, fall time. Someone could have got a life sentence in the fall time. Um, someone could be getting a great car in the fall time, have gotten a whatever. Okay, whatever and however this applies to your life, may it be a blessing, but get things organized here. And stay sober. I love you guys and peace.